Yeah. The Russian thing is just a big nothing burger. Really? Yeah. You don't think that? Uh... There's nothing there you can do. Get a break. The more seen in constantly like Russia this, Russia that. Because it's ratings. Because it's ratings. Our ratings are incredible right now. But honestly, you'd, you think the whole Russia shit is just like bullshit. Could be bullshit. I mean, we, it's mostly bullshit right now. Like, we don't have any big giant proof. I just feel like they don't really have it, but they, they want to keep digging. Mm -hmm. And so I think the president is probably right to say, like, look, you are witch hunting me. Like, you have no smoking gun. You have no real proof. And the CEO of CNN said in our internal meeting, he said, good job everybody covering the climate accords, but we're done with it, let's get back to Russia. <laughs> That's what's, I mean, I understand, it's all ratings, right? Oh, it's a business. So it's, it's a business. People are like, the media has like an ethical, but all the nice cutesy little ethics that used to get talked about in journalism school, you're just like, that's adorable. <laughs> that's adorable. <laughs> yeah, this is a business. Especially cable news. You know, cable news isn't the New York Times, and it's not, it's not even like NBC News. It's, it's, I mean, NBC News still gets 20 million viewers a night. Cable news is getting a million. So, um, like, they got to, they got to do what they got to do to make their money, I think. And so I love the, I love the news business, but I I find it so I'm fascinating. very cynical about it. At the same time, so are most of my colleagues. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm not alone. I think that there are a lot of like liberal CNN viewers who want to see Trump really get scrutinized and. I think if we would have behaved that way with President Obama and scrutinized everything that he was doing with as much scrutiny as we applied to Donald Trump, I think our viewers would have been turned off. I think they would have thought would, like we were attacking him. But um, I think our viewers right now, and I'm not saying all of our viewers are like super liberals. Right. I think there's just a lot of them. And so, so, so Trump's good for business, you're saying? Trump is good for business right now. But honestly, you'd you think the whole Russia shit is just like bullshit? Could be bullshit. I mean, we, it's mostly bullshit right now. Like, we don't have any big giant proof. But then they say, well, there's still an investigation going on. And you're like, yeah. I don't know. If you were finding something, you would, we'd know about it. The way these leaks happen, they'd leak it. It'd yeah. leak. If there was something really good, it would leak. And it would have leaked before uh, voting, I would say. Well, if they, right. if, that's, if, that's if anything was good out there, it would have came out already. Yeah, the leaks keep leaking, and there's so many great leaks, and it's amazing. And I just refuse to believe that if they had something really good like that, that, that wouldn't leak, because we've been getting all these other leaks. So I just feel like they don't really have it, but they, they want to keep digging. Mm -hmm. And so I think the president is probably right to say, like, Look, you are witch hunting me. Like, you have no smoking gun. You have no real proof. Three CNN staffers resigned, victims of fake news.